Hello everyone, I am Deepak Kunyal and I welcome you to the series of tutorials on Python programming. If you have seen my previous videos, then you might be knowing that we have discussed about Python string numbers or data structures. And after that, we discussed about Python numbers and random number generations. So all those things we are going to use in this program. So this is a program where we are going to ask user for some numbers and those numbers are in the range of low and high. Then we'll randomly assign a number in this range. And after that, we are going to ask user to guess that number. We can give him some chances. If he's able to guess the number correctly in those number of chances, then he wins the game. Otherwise, he loses. Here we are also providing a hint to the user whether that number entered by him is lower or higher than the actual number. So we can keep asking for the number until he guesses the correct number or accept his defeat. You can provide him unlimited number of chances or he can limit the number of chances clear so let's start so first we have to import random maybe you can import random in this way then you don't need to write random dot random at every place clear or you can just import random so let's start with two variables low and high and user have to input values there so you can write enter lower limit and for another number you have to write enter higher limit right and then you can pass integer here so that these values are not strings when we are operating on them after that uh, just check this whether this is correct or not so enter lower limit and we are entering 10 as lower limit and then higher limit 20 you can check the values and see its output clear so as of now we will keep writing these small statements and finally we will combine all these statements and make a larger program clear it's easier for us to write these statements and check their output so that it's easier to verify whether we are writing correct program or not clear so now you have to generate a secret number and what will be that secret number that should be between low and high so how can we generate a random number between a range you can use rand int or rand range and then pass low and high here or you can create your own statement and for that you have to write low plus random dot random which generates a number between 0 to 1 and that's a floating point number and you can then multiply that number with high minus low plus one and this number will be floating point number right so you can pass it inside int and this number will be converted into integer so just try to run this statement multiple time and see what secret number you are getting so print secret it's 15 or you can just write print statement here and see the output multiple time it's 14 now it's 14 again it's 11 it's 18 and so on so this will keep printing numbers between 10 to 20 now our task is to ask user to guess a number in the given range and check whether he is guessing correctly or not right and then you have to provide a hint to him as well so you start with this you can pick some chances maybe we want to give him 10 chances right so while chances so it means when he have chances he will keep guessing otherwise he will lose the game so I am assigning a variable guess and then you have to input the number guess the secret number so this is the message for user and when he has started guessing his chances will keep decrementing so now he has one chance less now what you have to check whether number that he has guessed is equal to secret number or not so if it is equal to secret number then you can print congratulation you win the game right but if this number is incorrect then you have to do something else 
but whenever he wins the game just break this loop and get out of it and for this thing when you are breaking the loop if he is winning or losing how will you know so for that you have to declare one more variable so you can make it win and assign it a false value and when he wins the game assign it true right so that you can check this thing after he breaks out of the loop clear now another condition we have to tell him whether the guest number is higher or lower than the actual number so write l if if guess is greater than secret so what does this mean it means that the number you are guessing is actually greater right so that means the secret number is less than guest number so what user needs to do now he need to guess a lower number clear otherwise so if secret number is not less than the guest number what could be the option it means secret number is greater than the guest number correct so now your program is over just go out of the loop and check here if not win so that means if it is false so not false will make it true and you can print a message here you lost the game clear so now let's do one thing let us combine our whole program and run it again so we have two things here we can put both the things here after that we have to generate a secret number so secret number is generated after this after that we have some number of chances so you can change this number of chances i am just making it three as of now All right so let's start running this program enter the lower limit it's 10 higher limit 20 now guess the secret number program has already guessed the number and that is the secret number now what we have to do we have to guess that number so i am guessing 15 and it is saying secret number is less than the guest number so that means i have to put some lesser value maybe 13 now it is saying it is greater and now i am clear that number is 14 of course and now it should say that congratulations you won the game clear we can run this program again and see it here i am copy and pasting this program again here so that you can see this output now i will provide a lower limit of 100 and higher limit of 200 so that it's difficult to guess the number guess the secret number maybe 150 secret number is less than the guest number so i will make it 130 it's still less and now i have one chance so it's highly unlikely that i will guess this number maybe 120 or i lost the game because secret number is less than the guest number so you can print this secret number here and see the output and it was 118 so i was a bit ahead of that but still when you lose the game you lose the game right so you can run this program create your own program in your own flavor and play with your friends or any other colleague so i hope you found this thing interesting once you learn all the data structures and constructs of the python programming you can develop many of the programs like this it was just a basic program but still it was interesting i hope uh, this is clear to you so if you have any doubt or query regarding any of these things or you want some project idea or you have some project ideas you can share in the comments and that will be very helpful for me and all other friends okay so see in the next video with some new concept till then thank you so much